Hey folks, it's Jay from Dumpster Diving Life. Well, it uh, happened again. I went out for a quick run and of course, I hit a pretty big haul. And of course, I wasn't videotaping. So, to make up for that, because this was one of the bigger ones of my, my uh, display hauls, retail display item hauls, I just felt compelled to to make a little video of it. I I'm really don't like, like making show and tell videos. Seems like bragging to me, but I don't mind watching them, but I just, I'm a little uncomfortable making them. So anyway, yeah, I just cleaned out the car. Uh, I was headed to, I was headed to the storage shed this morning to the page storage unit, about a mile from where we live. I had to get a table out of there that someone from Facebook marketplace was interested in. Matter of fact, that's the table right there. So actually a workbench. Um, unfortunately, she didn't buy it. Uh, too tall for her. So no no biggie. I still sold some glass. And I have some snap frames in there that's standing by the door. By the front door that are uh, waiting for another buyer. That's between 6 and 7 this evening. So I go to the storage unit to get the this, this table, this workbench. And I decided because my wife was gonna go meet some friends uh, as soon as I got back. And uh, I decided I might as well go ahead and do a quick run because I wouldn't get a chance. She won't be back until dark. And uh, I just had to go one more time, just felt compelled to go. I don't know, I think I'm getting a little obsessed with this, uh, that one particular roller, one particular department store. And, uh, but for a reason, because this came out of all of it. Now, I have to add one caveat. I haven't sold most of this stuff. These are price tags you stick on the shelves. Some stand up, some, and that one stands up. Some hook, I think most of them hook to a counter or to a display, like that one. But there are dozens and dozens and dozens, and this is just on top of the ones I've gotten in the last two weeks, so you're talking hundreds got more of the metal displays, stainless steel. These guys are heavy duty. They have a little slit in the top. You, you, they slide the cardboard um, sign in or the photograph for promotional or advertising purposes. I have dozens of these now. I have dozens of these now, smaller guys that just sit on a counter or sit, and sit on top of another display. Um, found half a dozen more of these added to the ones I've already found in the last couple of weeks. Um, I believe that makes my total up to uh, over 20. I believe I had 17, so over 20. And three random, uh, pretty nice uh, picture frames, award frames, with the awards and dedication still in there. I won't show those folks, but two wood, one plastic. And this guy here, uh, it's called craft paper, but really it's, uh, the storage bag, your um, packaging paper, also known as dunnage to some people. Uh, I use it a lot. I used it a lot when I was shipping uh, my uh, online sales, but I've cut way back. This thing is almost full and it's heavy. I don't know how heavy it is, but it is heavy. Uh, that goes, add that to the two large packages of uh, over 60 pounds of uh, wrapping paper I got recently. And coming on down here, got this really interesting, I have no idea, some type of measurement device. I'm going to have to look it up. Trailers, uh, Taylor's two, uh, True Fit. Some type of measuring device. It's really too short, short to measure height. It's too short to measure, measure height. I put it back here to stop it so you can lock it in. So I don't know. I think it's maybe a, a width measurement, I'm thinking. But, uh... Maybe for shoulders, men's shoulders, women's shoulders. Anyhow, he was in there. Um, this uh, folding folding frame was in there. Remember how to fold it. Anyhow, um, it had a, obviously it has it was a display. The display top is missing. And it has slots for one in the middle of it. So a two-tiered display. Uh, stainless steel if he folds this way you got to come this way there it is he was pretty tight um 
And then down here, I've already looked good. It looks like a full box of a, uh, of a uh, display rack. And I mean a full box, and I got three of them. They were brand, they're all brand new. Uh, they're small, I believe for shirts and maybe just some, a small display, but brand new and everything's there including the acrylic display sign for the uh, photographs and for the the uh, name of the product or whatever they're putting in there. So yeah, unbelievable, really unbelievable. Three boxes of those. And uh, moving on, some random items. I don't know what it is with some of these department stores. They like throwing out perfectly good tape dispensers. He's a little hard to get out, but just lift him up. He's good. Just clean me up a little bit, and they're good. I think this makes number six I've gotten from uh, this one department store. So a uh, random roll of orange tape, almost full. A full can of uh, mineral spirits. A full spray can of uh, all-purpose cleaner a first aid kit that most of the items are expired inside but I don't care I'll put it in my shop just for me it'll still work for me I uh, a working a working uh, paper towel dispenser that's the second one I've gotten can't remember where I got the first one these really really nice acrylic displays originally were those folks it has a little slit in the top so you can put your photo or your, your sign or message. Two of those. And guys, look how thick this acrylic is. This is some really nice stuff. Very expensive stuff. Uh, this is what really folks really like. So, uh, yeah, quite honestly, I haven't sold a whole lot. I've only listed a few of these, more of the, the flimsier ones, and a few of those. So, uh, no sales yet. So, I can't be saying for certain i'm on to something here so in a matter of fact i may have got myself uh, in a bind my wife doesn't appreciate me bringing so much home after we've cleared it out just recently because it was all the items i was bringing home sort of taking over the house the bedroom the game room the attic my shop so we cleared things out uh and now here i am bringing a carload of actually several carloads the last couple of weeks of items such as this back to the house. So I need to get busy, start listing these things and get them sold. Or uh, I just may well find myself on the stinky end of a divorce. So uh, I don't think I mentioned this guy, it's a tall little display, but uh, I didn't find the top, but I could pretty much improvise with him. It's loose, but it just screws in. There's, there's a loose bolt there. Really nice base. Once that bolt is tightened, it'll be a Dirty little little display. Uh, I didn't forget to mention this guy. You don't see these too often, but they're pretty pretty nice. The trash can was in the dumpster as well. I just used it to grab more of those because I was running out of the boxes. So anyhow, this is one of those really thick white acrylic. Still has the looks like someone's suggestion box, but uh, a little divider in there. Very solid, very heavy. Uh, I'll list that. That could be on a countertop at a flea market or at a thrift store somewhere. Oh, and I did forget to mention, four very nice drapes, curtains, drapes, whatever you want to call them. One has a slight tear at the very top, but in the back, near the back, and it cannot be seen when it's hung. So these are like new, almost brand new. I like the color, I like the style. Might even put them in my workshop when that one day is finished and complete and ready. Um, I believe that's it guys. I did have, I'm sorry, these are seven shelves. I believe they had, I remember seeing dis, uh, displays like this with blue jeans uh, displayed on them, but I really can't recall. Uh, this was, there was eight of them, but one was damaged and two, two damaged to take. So there's seven of these, pretty large, pretty tall and uh, beautiful cedar. They've got the metal brackets on it holding the board together and also got the little slots so you can slip them into a shelf or a 
a screw or whatever you however you want to hang them but uh really nice i'm going to get those listed as soon as i can and uh the uh bags over here that's some hangers i picked up probably a week ago uh from both bells and burt's and uh, they were in the storage unit they've been in the storage unit all this time i need to bring them home and separate them and get them uh separate the pants from the tops or the pant from the tops and uh because i'm getting more requests for pant hangers than anything so uh, in the pant are kind of hard to come by if i'm lucky out of these four bags i might get maybe a hundred pant hangers so uh yeah we'll see about that so there you go guys there's my show and tell um that was the day this was the early this morning and of course i've hit it all when my wife is waiting on me to get back to go meet her friends and uh yeah i was slinging things as quick as i could i wasn't using my grabber it's still broke i've got one ordered it's on the way but all of this was definitely a dive and one reason i was in such a hurry i couldn't videotape i didn't want to it would just would have slowed me down i'm still holding my phone and i was grabbing these things both hands trying to get them and get and uh I did, and she was happy, but it was a close one. I didn't show you the jewelry hooks. I do believe I have a display that will use these, and uh, just don't have it with me. I'm not even certain where I put it. It might be back in the storage unit, or it might be in the attic. I'm not certain. So now that I got the hooks to go with it, I'm going to bring it out and list it for sure. So, uh, yeah, that was uh, I'm pretty quite, quite a bit of them, too. I think I should show this display, just missing, missing the top acrylic sign, uh, plastic, lightweight, but uh, he'd be useful for something. So anyway, guys, okay, I'm rambling on. That's enough. That's it. I've shown you some of the odds and ends, and I've shown you my filthy, disorganized car. Now I got to get out of here and get this stuff organized and put away before my wife gets here and uh, gives me that look. And I don't want to see that look. So anyway, just kidding, guys. It's all good. She enjoys it. She likes, uh, she enjoys, especially when they sell, when my items sell. But she just doesn't like the clutter, and I can't blame her. So there's a good tip. If you don't have the space for it, guys, think twice about grabbing it. Maybe let someone else have it. And you concentrate on the smaller things. That's what I'm trying to do. But even the smaller things add up, as you see here. So, uh, yeah, that's just another good tip. Um, remember about the space that you have at your house and how it affects other folks you live with. It gets in their way too. And uh, if it doesn't sell, if it doesn't get listed, uh, it just sets around and becomes, as they say, a death pile. So I'll be busy tonight listing as much as this I can, as this I can. And uh, I've got a couple more people, at least one more coming over. Uh, from marketplace to uh, look at those frames. So hopefully that'll be a sell. My bench didn't sell, but some glass panels sold and those frames sold. So uh, can't can't win them all. But hopefully I'll get some more tomorrow. Being Sunday, that's usually the best day uh, I have found. So enough of that, folks. Enough of this. Enough of my dirty car, disorganized car. Enough of me rambling on. Guys, be safe. Wear your gloves. And uh, Always remember, keep what you must, sell what you need, give what you can. Stay safe. Subscribe, like, comment, and we'll see you in the next one.